parte de Santana and I'm back at Hado Crooks in Loma Linda this is my second time here this time I'm by myself I try and find the trolls because they're already on trail forks so that's good so I'm gonna do the same ones I did last time see how I do so clear today let's do this okay I think I'm looking for a side wine there Feels good to be back in the bike. Okay, so the last sidewinder is sit. So I'm gonna backtrack a little bit and then start it. It starts here. That, one, that was the one that runs on the edge with a lot of exposure. It's fun. Okay, sit. Let's do this. I've been off the bike for a little bit over 30 days. Okay, this way. I don't remember where it goes. Here we go. That foot down. Woo. Little slide right there. Everything fine, feels good. My arm, my right arm, still feeling a little bit on the bumps. Oh, look at this turn. Oh man. Miss that feeling. Just flying through that. Low clearance. Woo. A little bit off the trail. Yeah. That's fun. Oh. Nice. Oh. Yeah, my arm. Since I feel on this arm, so you can tell. Or no, you can see. If I feel on this arm, I feel it right here. I feel like this. And then my pinky. Then I got full range of motion. And I'm back. Feeling good. Now let's look for a pinball trail. Oh, oh man, I missed this. Whew. Nice views today from Loma Linda. Snow covered mountain tops. I'm, at, I'm about to do pinball. So let's do this. Second time I do this show. First time I was here with Dexter. And I wasn't feeling good that day. I think I had a stomach ache. Oh, a little bit of water there. I remember this is super steep. Oh, muddy. Oh, damn it. Looks like I'm not going fast today on this one.
bridge. Do you need the speed for here? All right, that happens. <sighs> About a moderate speed. Stop. This one is just steep. Okay, no, it doesn't get too steep now. Oh, so I need to lower those heels. Ah, I'm out of my mouth. I feel like I'm over the bike. A little bit. I feel like my heels are high too. That's not good. There we go. The first section is tough because uh, you just want to break, but you need your speed for everything. Uh, it's still tough as I can remember. Oh, now let's go back up and try to hit as many jumps as I can on the main road. Uh, that was good. That was fun. Whew. All right, let's finish this short ride today. Just getting back. Don't want to push it, but feeling good. That was going to be doing worse. And this is basically the main, the main line to go up and down. Well, mainly to go up, but there's a jump line on your way down. Last time I think I skipped all of them. Need more speed. Got a bomb truck. See if I can pick up speed. <sighs> yeah, I need more speed. If I don't cure these gaps. Keep the feet up. Woo! No brake check right there. Thank you. Okay. Drop too flat. Nothing too bad. I don't know this area, so if something doesn't look clearable, I'm not gonna do it. That's a nice one right there, huh? Thank 
Thank you. Yeah, you gotta go quick for that. Okay, yeah, let's drop. Double. I don't know. Yeah, this is our gap too. Need lots of speed. Keeps going more and more front sections. Oh. Take a break. Woo. Nice. Need speed for those. Do this a gap or a hug for flat. Oh, yeah, it's a gap. I didn't remember it. So I discovered today, even though I was injured for like a month, a few days, I'm still comfortable. Because when you think about it, it wasn't my fault that I pedal strike and fell. So if it was like in a turn and I was taking too fast or something that I knew was my fault, I would have probably been like, yeah, I would take it easy. And continues through here. Thank you for watching. Like, share, and subscribe for my videos. And for another video, throw those straws for your living. And if you want to hunt about together, send me an email.